welcome, dear friends, to beautiful Costa Rica and to this lovely setting by the sea. We are gathered here today on this joyous occasion to unite you, Ryan, and Ali in marriage. This celebration is but the outward sign of an inward union of hearts, mind, and spirits. In marriage, husband and wife are called to a new way of life, to live faithfully together, in plenty and in want, in joy and in sorrow, in sickness and in health. Love makes burdens lighter because you divide them. It makes joys more intense because you share them. It makes you stronger. You can be involved with life in ways you dare not risk alone. Happiness in marriage is not something that just happens. A good marriage must be created. It is never being too old to hold hands. It is remembering to say, I love you at least once a day. It is never going to sleep angry. It is at no time taking the other for granted. The courtship should not end with the honeymoon. It should continue through all the years. It is standing together, facing the world. It is doing things for each other in the spirit of joy. It is not only marrying the right partner, it is being the right partner. Ryan, do you take Allie to be your lawfully wedded wife? Do you promise to love, honor, and protect her? Share the good times and achievements, as well as the hard times and disappointments. Keep her in sickness and in sorrow, and be faithful to her so long as you both shall live. I do. Having heard those wonderful words, Ali, do you take Ryan to be a lawfully wedded husband? Do you promise to love, honor, and protect him? Share the good times and achievements as well as the hard times and disappointments. Keep him in sickness and in sorrow, and to be faithful to him so long as you both shall live? I do. After six years, our relationship begins. I will trust you over all others, be faithful to you over all others, kiss you even when you're sick. I promise to help push you up steep hills, both literally and figuratively. I dedicate myself to you. I give you my hand and my heart, my ears for your troubles and triumphs. Some cupboards you will have to close, some lost things you will have to find because my eyes are only for you. I shall strive to be the best friend, husband, and father I can be now and for the rest of my life. After six years, our relationship begins today. Every day, I will tell you I love you. Every day, I will hug you. Every day, I will embrace our playful nature. I will love your facial hair no matter what the style. I will support you in all of your goals and I will cheer for your success. I dedicate myself to you. I give you my hand and my heart and sometimes I will give you my purse to hold. I will be a binding force and protect our love. I shall strive to be the best friend, wife, and mother I can be now and the rest of my life. The wedding ring is the outward and visible sign of an inward and spiritual bond which unites two loyal hearts in endless love. Accept this ring. As a reminder of the love we share. The commitment we make here today. And the symbol of our future. Together as husband and wife. Ryan and Ali. May your love always be as constant as the never-ending waves flowing endlessly from the depths of the sea. Just as the waters touch and nourish the many shores of the earth, may your love be a moving sea between the shores of your souls. Just as there will never be a morning without the ocean's flow, there will never be a day without your love for each other. By virtue of the authority vested in me by the laws of the Republic of Costa Rica and recognized by the United States, I now have the pleasure of pronouncing you husband and wife. Congratulations, you may kiss the bride. <laughs> wife! <laughs> <laughs>